in this video we will learn how to use wildcard route in angular application angular application will works in the browser uh, in the browser user has the complete control on the url what will happen if the user is entering wrong url let's see here we are using the same bookstore application and it is running uh, in the browser with this url now click this about us how it works login all books book details app everything is working fine now uh, what will happen if i add some extra text in the url like this then press enter you can see here we are getting an error in the console window the error is cannot match any route uh, whatever we write in the url that does not match with any route in this application and we are back to home page this is not an ideal way to handle this situation in this scenario if the user is entering some wrong data in the url then we need to show 404 page let's see how we can do that go to vs code editor here to display 404 page let's create one more component let's open the terminal window i will add this new component in this shared module um, you can add this component at any place in the terminal window to generate a new component we have to use this anglo cli command ng g and then c i want to create this new component inside this uh, shared module um, in the shared folder i want to create a new components folder then component name let's say not found then press enter it will create a new component inside this shared module let's see see here inside this shared folder we have components folder inside this components folder we have one more folder not found here we have four new files okay now let's open this html file here instead of this message let's write uh, some message using p tag the page does not exist here let's say click here to go to home page now i want to make this uh, here as clickable link um, for that we can use anchor tag okay here we will use router link um, navigate to the home page we can simply use forward slash here and save the changes now let's open this app module file here in the imports array let's add shared module and save the changes now let's open this app routing module file here we have to create a uh, one more route so copy this line and put a comma here and paste it below that here in the path uh, we have to provide double asterisk if you are providing the double asterisk uh, then the anglo will display the component that you will write here so here we have to use not found component like this and save the changes go back to the browser see here we are getting a uh, message from not found component and see here this here is not a clickable link let's see what happened the router link is not work uh, in the shared module in the imports array let's use a uh, router module and save the changes go back to the browser see here it is clickable link okay now now click this all book link we are getting uh, this 404 page error okay now click this login again we are getting uh, the 404 page error okay already we have the component uh, corresponding to this login and all books route but instead of that component we are getting a not found page component for this go back to vs code editor in app routing module file we are defining this uh, particular path at the last uh, the order of the routes matter 
allowed in the angular application by default angular search for uh, top to bottom but if there is no corresponding route then by default this particular route will be used let's see in the app module file we are using this app routing module at the top level all other routes uh, that is hot user public and shared module we are using at the bottom side instead of using this app routing module at the top level let's use it uh, in the bottom like this and save the changes go back to the browser okay now go to home page here we are getting an error uh, this time click the login so it works fine then all books book details app so all are work fine um, if I enter some wrong URL we are getting a not found page okay now go to VS code editor now let's understand one more scenario in app routing module file uh, let's update this order so use this at the top level and save the changes now go back to browser here click this about us and how it works login works and all books these three pages working fine but about us and how it works we are getting this not found page for this about us and how it works but all these other pages are working fine for that uh, go to vs code editor because um, in app module file we are using all other modules above the app routing module um, in app routing module file we have defined uh, these two paths below the wildcard route when the angular search for exact path uh, it will come in the middle then there will not be further search and this will get displayed remember um, we have to use this path at the bottom level of all the routes so make this save the changes and go back to browser click all the links all are working fine now enter some wrong url and press enter we are getting a not found page okay this is how we can handle while code route in angular application if you like this video hit the like button and subscribe to this channel for more videos thanks for watching this